Welcome to Save on Plants. This info video will be focusing on beech trees. Beech trees are very popular for their color and for their corrugated leaf texture. Beech trees in general are considered to be quite hardy, except for the tricolor beech, which can be a little bit delicate. It prefers to have only about half day sun, preferably morning sun only, and it does not like to be in windy locations. None of the beaches, though, like wet locations. They cannot be planted in swales or any rare area where uh, the moisture, the, the wetness, is going to sit there for a long period of time. Uh, never plant them in front of a downspout from a house, etc. Uh, they, they do need to be watered, obviously, uh, but they can't sit in water for very long. They have to, the water has to drain quickly from their root system, otherwise uh, they will not survive. Uh, they are grafted at the base, so when you are planting a beech tree, you have to be careful not to push too hard on the trunk if you're trying to adjust the location. Uh, you're best to move it by handling the root ball rather than the trunk itself, otherwise you could risk cracking the graft itself. All of the beech trees that we sell are field grown, which provides a much stronger, healthier tree than the ones that are protected in greenhouses and grown in very light soil. This is our biggest seller. It's the DeWick Purple. It provides a very deep purple reddish type of leaf, very dense foliage, and is used widely for privacy between neighbors, along fences, and along driveways. This is the Weeping Purple Beach, similar leaf to the, to, to the DeWick Beach. However, it has a weeping shape as well as uh, much wider, so you would not use this uh, as a privacy hedge in a subdivision, for example. Uh, this is more of a specimen tree that would be used in the center of a flower bed or the center of a front yard. Beech trees are not the fastest growing trees around. They tend to be on the slow side, but they can become extremely large over time. They live for two to three hundred years, and if you ever do see a, a large beech tree, they are absolutely amazing and beautiful plant. Uh, but it can take hundreds of years literally for them to get large, but I've seen them at over 100 feet across. Here is another weeping purple beech. And depending on how they're pruned, they will have a different shape. This one's been allowed to grow a little bit taller in an upright position, where the one a few slides back was pruned so that it would stay shorter. Here is a weeping green beech, very similar in profile to the weeping purple beech. Uh, these pictures really don't do beech trees justice because you don't see the corrugation of the leaves. Uh, you pretty well have to see the trees in person to really appreciate how beautiful they are. This is a very sought after variety of beech. It's called the tricolor beech and for obvious reasons it is an absolutely beautiful plant because of its leaf coloring. Uh, this can range from this deep pink that you see uh, to just an off-white. Uh, it's, it's a very pretty tree and uh, you won't see too many of them around for the reason that they are delicate. Of all the beech trees, these ones can be quite delicate. The other varieties tend to be very hardy, but the tricolor tends to be delicate. It prefers to have only morning sun and it not windy location. It likes to have a sheltered area. Here is another photograph of a different uh, tricolor beech and you can see how the coloration is different than the previous one. This will be based on the type of soil. It will have an effect on the leaf color as well as the amount of sun exposure. Now we're more than happy to uh, share our info uh, files with you. Uh, they're available on the on YouTube, etc. at our website. In addition, you can come in with your own USB uh, transfer stick and we will transfer uh, the whole library over onto your transfer stick, uh, no charge of course, and uh, you'll have a, probably a little higher quality and maybe a little bit easier to view than being on YouTube. So feel free to bring your, um, your stick in. Uh, if we're delivering to you, uh, we'll bring a, a USB stick with us and you can borrow that while we're unloading. You can load it onto your computer. We're always very happy to share whatever information we can give you. From all of us at Save on Plants, we wish you a very happy gardening season. And please be sure to watch our other info videos, especially the ones on watering and planting. Thank you very much.